is inarticulate words of thanks <laughs> as a, as a uh, true expression of gratitude because they come from the heart. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you very much. When, according to African tradition, you visit the chief, you don't go with empty hands. You go with two bottles of schnapps. <laughs> you go with two bottles of schnapps. And on this occasion, we have brought the schnapps. <laughs> yes, yes indeed. Two bottles of intellectual schnapps. <laughs> yes, that's good. intellectual schnapps. <laughs> right that is yes, yes. two volumes of my poetry. Ah, thank you. And um, uh, they are Freedom Symphony, Selected and New Love Poems, Mandela de Spear, and other poems. Yes, and I have the honor of presenting them on behalf of our delegation mm -hmm. and on behalf of the Pan-African Writers Association to the one and only Dr. Ishmael Seragel. Doctor, there is one thing I must say. Ideas do not fall from the sky. They are generated by the human heart, the human mind. We are privileged to be members of the Board of Governors of the Millennium Excellence Award. This has come about because of the unique vision and spirit of determination and enterprise of a young man called Ashim Morton. Here he is, the founder. Um, again, I thank you for taking the time to meet with us this morning. Um, after Professor Atukwe Okain has spoken and good recipient, Dr. Ismail Salagelda. I don't think I have much more to say, but to say thank you for the time that you've taken out, and uh, that we're looking forward to seeing you in Ghana. I think it's going to be a day that the entire world will be very proud of. Um, let me take this opportunity again to thank you for meeting with us. I'll ask uh, Honorable Sami Nkrumah to say a few words before I conclude. So, Honorable Sami. On behalf of our life patron, mm -hmm. the king of the Ashanti, Osei Tutu II, the Asantehini, on behalf of our chairman, the founder of the Millennium Excellence Awards, and my colleagues, many of whom are not here. We are 11 in all. On beh behalf of everyone involved in this precious project, I want to thank you first, all of you, for receiving us so warmly, for giving us time and attention. I must say I am overwhelmed too, and I think I can honestly say these words on behalf of everyone. The two hours we've spent at the Bibliotheca has really inspired all of us here. For us, taking this step goes beyond the call of duty. We came here principally to invite you to accept this award. These awards are intended, amongst other things, to inspire our young people, to inspire them to look towards our models of excellence, to inspire them to give, to inspire them to serve, to inspire them to sacrifice. But we're, here we are, totally carried away 
with the beauty and richness of this place, that we are sitting planning into the future. We are sitting thinking that we've been given a wonderful gift and we must build on it. For many of us, our political independence in Africa is just a first step. In fact, the leaders of our independence told us that we are gaining political independence only as a means to achieve socio-economic and cultural emancipation. This great project is one of those steps, remarkable steps, along the road 